All right, so what we're looking at is a swing cylinder for a 350E John Deere backhoe. And uh, if you're trying to disassemble this puppy, you have to take this outer ring off, which these little notches here, I just used a punch, uh, like so. Hammer that thing counterclockwise until it turns. You just have to keep working at it till it starts to turn and then it'll just spin right off. Leaving some threads uh, showing right here. And then you take a hammer or punch and you drive that threaded piece back in there. Uh, and then you'll see a snap ring exposed, which is this piece here. So you have to get a little screwdriver like so, get underneath that thing. And uh, I just bent a little uh, scrap screw screwdriver I had. I just bent a little scrap screwdriver I had with a hook on it. So when I got that thing popped up, I hooked on it, and pulled it out, and then I, with, the, with uh, these two tools, one, handmade just out of a I guess I got this to repair my phone years ago they sent it to me free with the screen anyway I just bent it and use it for a snap ring puller okay so you got that out um, and of course that is the hardest part um, the thing that they, you have to do there's a little red you can't really see it now but there's a little red plastic ring that came with the kit that you have to put in the place where the snap ring was so that when you pull this rod out you won't scratch uh, scratch the components as they come out so that's the most important thing to remember on a swing cylinder is to, to remember to get put that little red uh, plastic ring that comes with the kit in that slot I basically got the two loose ends and put them in the slot and then work the rest around each way uh, to try to get it nice and smooth all the way around um, so then uh, you do this just like every other cylinder after that. You get to come along and pull this out. Of course this is loose here so that uh, you're not trying to pull against uh, uh, fluid. So you got an air intake there. So you pull this thing out, replace your seals, the rest of the seals, put them on just like they come off, clean everything thoroughly, and then put that back in. Well once you get uh, once you get it back in, um, you're going to have to remember to take that red uh, plastic temporary uh, ring out and then put your snap ring back. Uh, push this in and put your snap ring in and pull it out until uh, the, the threads are sh can be grabbed to hold of with this ring. Tighten it all up and then you're, you're good to go. All right, that's how to repair a swing cylinder on a John Deere 350E backhoe. And uh, there you go. Good luck.